Hi, I'm Morten Jens and I'm the RF Group Leader. I'm responsible for making sure we get the RF systems delivered for ESS. So what is RF? RF stands for radio frequency and it is a kind of uh, electromagnetic radiation just like what you have at home in your microwave or just like visible light. The only difference is here the wavelength is different and the frequency is different. We need RF in order to accelerate the beam when it's going through the tunnel and for that we need power at the right frequency and the right wavelength. So here we are running uh, the RF system which is a 3 megawatt system. This one is for the RFQ and we have a number of subsystems that are part of this. We have the modulator in the background and that powers the klystron which then acts as an amplifier that takes us from 100 watt to about 3 megawatt. And then in the background we have all of the control systems, interlock systems, EPICS integration and all of the subsystems required to run the system. So the RF group consists of 18 people at the moment including myself. Uh, that's a mixture of engineers and technicians. But of course we also work very closely with our other uh, partners within Accelerator. For example uh, modulators with ICS for EPICS integration and timing and so on. In order to get the equipment, a lot of the equipment come directly from commercial suppliers where we place contracts, but we also have of course a lot of equipment coming from in-kind. So for example for the RFQ system itself, we have the Klystron, uh, the low level RF systems and the waveguides, they have all come from our in-kind partner and ESS Bilbao, um, and then we've had a lot of help uh, with IFJPAN who is our installation teams here who have been doing all of the mechanical installations for us.